Hello everyone, welcome back to Garden Vibes. Today I am going to show you how to grow spinach right on your balcony. I think spinach is versatile veggie due to its ability to blend into wide range of dishes from salad to sandwiches, smoothies to different gravies. Its mild flavor and tender texture make it adaptable to various cuisines and its nutrient density adds both flavor and nutrition to the recipes. Growing spinach is simple and rewarding way to enjoy fresh homegrown greens. So let's get started. First thing first, for the soil mix I am taking 30% garden soil, 30% cocoa peat, 30% compost and remaining 10% combination of bone meal, mustard cake and neem cake. Neem cake helps protect roots from termites and soil grubs. This mix provides necessary macro and micronutrients. Also it helps in moisture retention while preventing waterlogged roots. Next, choosing the right container is important. Make sure it has good drainage to prevent overwatering. You can use planter box, large pot or grow bags. I am using this rectangular pot which has around 12 inches width and length of 18 inches. Fill your container with high quality potting mix and leave about an inch of space at the top for watering. Now it's time to plant your spinach seeds. Sprinkle the seeds evenly over the soil surface and cover with thin layer of soil mix. Now water your spinach gently without disturbing the seeds. You can use watering can or spray bottle for this. Now for couple of days keep the soil consistently moist but avoid overwatering. Place your container in spot on your balcony that receives at least 4 to 6 hours of sunlight per day. Spinach seeds typically start to sprout and emerge from the soil about 7 to 14 days after sowing depending on various factors such as soil temperature, moisture level and the specific spinach variety you are growing. However, warmer soil temperature and consistent moisture can lead to quick germination. About watering schedule, spinach requires regular watering. In most cases, you may need to water your spinach every day, depending on weather conditions. However, I will suggest always depend on the moisture level of soil rather than any fixed schedule. Adjust your watering schedule based on weather conditions. Hot and dry weather may require more frequent watering, while cool and rainy conditions may require less. Remember that spinach prefers consistent moisture but dislike being waterlogged. Always monitor the soil moisture and adjust your watering accordingly to keep your potted spinach thriving. After about 2 weeks you can start fertilizing your spinach. You can use any good quality compost. I generally use kitchen or vermicompost for all my veggies. Just add handful of compost to each pot. Do this every 2-3 to three weeks for big and lush leaves. Talking about pest control, spinach generally considered to be less susceptible to pest infestations compared to some other plants. Some common pests that may affect spinach include aphids, leaf miners and white flies. For these pests, you can use natural remedies like soap solution or any organic pesticides to protect your spinach. Time to harvest If you prefer tender baby spinach leaves, you can start harvesting when the leaves are small and young, usually around 3-4 to four weeks after sowing. For mature spinach leaves, you can wait until the leaves reach 6 inches or more in length. This may take around 6 to 8 weeks after sowing, depending on growing conditions. Harvesting in the morning when the leaves are crisp can result in best flavor and texture. Use scissors or knife to cut the outer leaves. 
allowing the inner ones to continue growing this way you can have continuous harvest and then you have your fresh spinach from your own garden similarly you can grow coriander methi amaranthus or any leafy greens on your balcony growing spinach or any leafy greens on your balcony is rewarding and easy project that results in fresh nutritious greens right at your doorstep remember to keep your plants well watered in good sunlight and free from pests and you will be enjoying your balcony grown veggies in no time if you found this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more gardening tips and tricks if you have any questions or suggestions feel free to leave them in the comments below thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video happy gardening